Welcome to Arsenal Online. Here you'll find the latest stories and news about Arsenal. Welcome back fellow Gunners across the world. Arsenal have to make Jed Spence transfer decision. It feels like a long time since Arsenal were knocked out of the FA Cup at the third round stage, but the impression left by Jed Spence has been long-lasting. As Mikel Arteta's side prepare to face Wolves in the Premier League, potentially without key right-back Takiro Tomiyasu, who is injured, the speculation surrounding Spence has intensified. Spence's performance in Nottingham Forest's 1-0 victory over the Gunners earlier in January was most definitely noticed, and at one point there were rumours of a transfer deadline day move for the defender with the Gunners and Tottenham vying for his signature. In the end, as we are well aware, nothing happened at Arsenal and no bid arrived for this talented defender. However, Another excellent performance at right wing-back in Forrest's 4-1 victory over Leicester has kept Arsenal fans clamouring for their club to make a summer move for the player. And now it seems that the 21-year-old could have some admirers in the Arsenal hierarchy as well. Reports have suggested that Spence, who is a childhood friend of Emile Smith-Rowe, was a subject of interest from the Gunners and still could be in the market for a right-back move this summer. And his prowess has caught the eye of Arsenal legend Ian Wright, in particular, who was singing Spence's praises on his Wrighty's House podcast after Forrest's win against the Gunners last month. He said, I saw him after the game against Arsenal and said, listen my friend, you're on loan from Middlesbrough and I don't know what's happened there because if you can't get into the Middlesbrough side, I don't know what's wrong so I need to know the full story. But let me say, that was one of the best right back performances I have seen for a very long time, a very long time. He continued, if we are talking about right backs performing at an unbelievable level, we're talking Rhys James and Trent Alexander Arnold. But I have not seen a combative, technical, swashbuckling performance like that for a very long time. High praise indeed from legend Wrighty. But the Arsenal faithful could be in for yet another disappointment as manager Arteta is urging caution and it seems that for now Arsenal's interest in the 21 year old has waned slightly as Arteta doesn't feel he's the right player for his squad. Whichever new right back, if there is a new right back, that will join the Gunners, they will have to do so knowing that their chances of regular football are highly limited as Tomiyasu is the undisputed number one at the club. If only they could clone him. What do you think? Leave a comment below to let us know. Thank you for watching Arsenal Online. Please subscribe and ring that bell for all the latest Arsenal news.